we go. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more DCS. Now, a little bit of a different video today. In recent times, there's been a few comments, um, basically on my display videos, asking how to set up the Airshow camera. So, rather than copy and paste the same comment, I thought, you know what, why don't I just put together a video that actually shows you? Because it might actually be easier to see what's happening on screen rather than just sort of reading something. I certainly learn something better by seeing how it happens than reading how it happens. So you've just done some cool moves in your jet. You want to record it back. Maybe you want to do an air display. Who knows? However you want to use this camera, you can use this camera as you wish. But I use it as the airshow camera, which basically means I have it locked in a position and it's fixed on the aircraft. And then you can zoom in, you can zoom out. And once you lock it to the aircraft, the camera will always follow the jet, unless you unlock it. So we're in the cockpit of an SU-27 right now. This is a display that I already recorded. Um, it was actually a bit of an eight minute um, crazy video, which you'll see on the channel soon. But I figured let's get the airshow camera out of the way. So we're in the standard cockpit view and we're gonna press F11. Now you can see it's taken us to Anapa. Now all we're going to do is scroll through until we get to the airfield where you are. And now in my case that's Kutaisi. So we're just going to scroll through. We will get there eventually. Here we are, Kutaisi. Now from here, if you use your mouse, you can look around. And if you use your scroll wheel, you can move the camera forward. It's basically a free view look. At this point, you can do anything you want with the camera. So we can go a little bit quicker. And there's our SU-27 there. If I reduce the scroll wheel, you can stop. So you can scroll, pause the camera in any position you wish and you're free to look around or you can use this sort of shot to get a jet taxi in. But what we want is the airshow camera. So, I generally position my camera around about the sort of the center point of the runway. It's not scientifically done, I just usually pick a spot. And we can hear the SU-27 powering up, which is good timing. So I am going to pop my camera here now all I'm going to do is scroll back, scroll forward on my mouse wheel to stop. We're going to move a little bit further forward towards the runway. Then we're now free to look around. So once you've moved your camera into position, this is where the camera will stay. Now the S I am taking off on the taxiway, yes. Now as the SU-27 gets into the sky, what we are going to do is press the delete key on our numpad. That is going to lock the camera to your jet. Now if you use the right control key and the star key on your numpad, you will then zoom in on the jet. So if we do that now, you can see we're zooming in on the jet. And if you press and hold right control and the forward slash key, you will zoom out. And it's it really is as simple as that. If you press the delete key on your numpad again, the camera will unlock. You can reposition it. You can put it wherever you want. Let's jump over to the other side of the runway. And let's slow down and pop it here. Same thing again. Press the delete key on your numpad. It lock to the aircraft, right control and star, you can zoom in. SU-27 pulling up into the sky, full afterburners. And if you press and hold right control and the forward slash key again, you'll zoom out. And it really is as simple as that, it's literally F11, use your scroll wheel to move the camera forward and back. Wherever you set that camera, that's where it will stay. And then you've got your right control star. 
and right control forward slash and those are the controls that are literally on my numpad so there you go that is a quick video on how to set up the airshow camera in dcs and whilst whilst i am here and just before i do go thank you for the huge support on the airshow display videos i'm glad to see that they've been getting some uh, strong views i'm glad you guys enjoy watching them so there you go your airshow camera is all set up ready to go and with that i will love you and leave you happy flying guys thank you as always for watching until next time take care stay safe this is liquid signing off <laughs>